Cape Canaveral, Florida, um, to do something that's definitely on our bucket list and the bucket list of a lot of people. And so we are going to watch the Falcon 9 launch and bring two astronauts to the International Space Center. I just saw a little baby gator in the road, I'm sorry. There was a baby gator? I just saw a gator in the road. What? It was. I, I missed it. You <laughs> missed it. Okay. Well, <laughs> how do I pick back up here? So, <laughs> so yeah, we're we're going to watch a rocket launch. Hopefully, we'll get really close. Um, yeah, we're going to. Uh, it's called Space View Park. This park is about fifteen miles. Um, you know, which is not too far, but I mean, it's not as close as we want, but I think it's still a good view. Um, it's like right across from the Kennedy Space Center. So it should be a good view and we're getting there pretty early. SpaceX and NASA working together, super cool. So yeah, we're, we're really excited. Yeah, hopefully it doesn't get um, postponed though, because we've been checking the weather like every, I don't know, few hours for Cocoa Beach and it's saying rain for the majority of the day so we're crossing our fingers that it stops raining during the time that the launch is supposed to happen. Yeah that's the only thing it was already canceled on Wednesday and rescheduled for today but there might be some rain there might be storms yeah. Uh, so it, it'll be interesting, but we're hoping for the best. We're hoping to see a rocket launch. It'd be the first time that I would like actually see a rocket going up in person. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's gonna so, be yeah. so crazy. I'm excited. Fingers crossed. Okay, so we found parking. This place is crazy, and we got here like three and a half hours early, <laughs> which we thought that would be enough, but. I guess not. <laughs> We've never done something like this, so like, we have no idea. <laughs> okay, so we finally found our spot after Dan here made me move everything two there times. Was there was that. I picked everything up that we brought with us. But I didn't want to lose the spot because, so it's it's happening in between the gazebo, or well, and the, the tree line that we're seeing here. It's yeah. Like, we're in like a pretty good spot, I feel, so. Good job, Dan. We did it. We found the spot. We did it. So now we wait for yeah. about three hours. And we also have fish jumping out here too, so. It's a full sitting experience. Sitting in the morning sun I'll be sitting when the evening comes Watching the ships roll in Then I watch them roll away yeah. I'm sitting on the dock of the bay, watching the tide roll away. All right, so we got rained on a couple of times, um, but we're underneath this palm tree, um, which has been shading us a little bit. But. The launch is supposed to happen at 3.22. We're an hour, about an hour and 15 minutes away from the launch time. So, I'm getting excited. Are you excited? Yes, I am. I was just drinking. <laughs>
Sitting in the morning sun I'll be sitting when the evening comes Watching the ships roll in And then I'll watch them roll away again Yeah, I'm sitting on the dock of the bay Watching the tide roll away Sitting on the dock of the bay, wasting time. I left my home in Georgia, headed for the Frisco Bay. Cause I've had nothing 